Before I name this my sentence, I must tell you. Duncan, Royland, this house needs you both. But you can only choose one, my lord. Let him be on with it. I get that. Many thought either of you would make a fine sentinel, but I have made my decision. Fuck. Sir Royland de Gore, you will be my sentinel. Don't hate me, guys. I'm sorry. Let's be praised. I need. You've done well, Lord Ethan. I need you someone that is, is stern Poor at the choice, moment because. Forgive me for saying so, but it's true. Now, Sentinel, what do you have to report of Ramsey Snow? My scouts say he's a day's ride away. We've no time to waste. He'll arrive before any of our allies could be here. Who knows what he's capable of? We need to prepare for the worst. There's no need to panic. We can devise a plan to deal with him. The Boltons need our people to harvest the ironwood. Even the bastard Ramsay must understand that. He's not coming here to negotiate. We must answer with the sword. That's bloody suicide. You gamble with the lives of everyone within these walls. Quiet, Tuttle. You're not the Sentinel. I knew this would happen. He cannot be trusted. This is the small council, is it not? Enough! Would my father have stood for this kind of bickering? Neither will I. Dude, you're my sentinel, but you only take man. action when I Force fucking tell you. They understand. Put every man who can hold a spear or crossbow on the wall and make the bastard fill his boots with piss. He would see it for the empty gesture that it is and have us flayed. We must take a measured approach, my lord. Gentlemen, please. We all must agree on the plan. We cannot leave until we have a consensus. Ugh. Why not make an offering for peace, my lord? Chair, yeah, the wisdom of the Citadel. We can give the Boltons ironwood in exchange for their protection. You must be mad. It's pure folly to just give away the only currency we have to bargain with. Enough! Although Sir Royland may object, I shall use diplomacy with Lord Snow. I would be foolish to pick a fight without negotiating first. I'll offer our allegiance and try to reach a reasonable agreement. If, you are if that doesn't work, then you can go kill everyone. That's what I need you here for. Ethan That's what you're here for. Prepare for the fight. You will and I will do this diplomacy thing. You are the fucking contingency, bro. You're the contingency. Forgive us, my lord. We are, of course, here to serve you, as we served your father. Aye. Well, then, God, I'm probably such a terrible fucking lord, but whatever. Let's decide for Ramsay's arrival. Invite him into this hall. Give the son of a bitch bread and salt. Face. Lord to lord. Ramsay Snow is no lord. That's absurd. You meet him at the gate with as much force as we can muster. Make him wait. Let him gaze upon Ironrath. And when he enters, he'll know it's only because you allowed it. Lord Ethan? Ooh, what do I do? Do I invite him? To... I will meet him at the gate. Fuck Ramsay. Very good, my lord. I shall prepare the men. Men? We hardly have any. It's a foolish plan. That's enough from you, Tuttle. Lord Ethan has spoken. Obey his command. Fuck it. I've faithfully served Fuck it, this house man. for far okay. too long to sit here and listen to this. Oh, me, shit, it's breaking down, you guys. You are too young to be the lord of this house. You're likely to get us all killed. Sit down at once. Damn, Ethan. Turning to the dark side. Apologies, my son. But now that it is settled, we know what we must do. You will meet Ramsay Snow at the gate. And we will not offer our ironwood. No matter what, Fuck I will that. stand beside you, my lord, where your sentinel belongs. Then perhaps we should adjourn. We have to prepare the house.
My lord, you have named your sentinel, but you still seem conflicted. And no matter what, you can't be indecisive. Not if you want to help this house. Forgive me. There will always be those who question your leadership. Which is why you need allies you can rely on. Family. What about your brother, Asher? Malcolm told me. You want to bring him back. He's a skilled fighter. But what's more, he has the will to fight. A hunger for it. He always protected you and your sister. And we need all the help we can get. Do you remember the Miller's boy? How he tormented you? I wanted to intervene, but your father said, Ethan must fight his own battles. But when Asher saw it, he didn't take a breath. He grabbed the Miller's boy by the neck. That was his first instinct. Asher knocked out half the poor boy's teeth. God of course, damn, your Asher. father was furious, but you were in danger and there was nothing else Asher needed to know. Asher does not hesitate. He acts, and we need that. You have many fine qualities. But you do not have that anger inside you. It's something we could use. You're a thinker, I don't know what's... You contemplate, and a lord needs that. But a lord also needs swords. Thanks, Mom. That's why I had that other guy's sentinel, because I will do the, the diplomacy thing, family. and what then he can just handle needs. killing all the people. Ethan, that is that is my decision. That's how we're playing the game. Fine. Malcolm will go to Essos and bring Asher back. That's kind of weird though, because like, technically Asher is like, oh no, because he's banished I'm technically. Glad you will let me do but... This. Know that you never stand uh, It's just weird. You are a forester. Mira stands with us, and she may be able to help us yet. Uh, let's see how this plays out, guys. Milady. What? You? Begging your pardon, Milady. I hope I didn't frighten you. How long have you been waiting there? Not long. I was just passing by when I saw you emerge from Lady Marjorie's room. I hope you saw. I was right before. About Lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. I just want you to know, I... I can help you if you'd like. And your family, if you're willing to trust me. I hear all sorts of things. Things that could be useful for you. How can you help me? My problems can't be solved by what you might overhear. Which is why you must trust me, milady. You need allies. Hopefully I've proven I've been useful to you. I'm sorry. I... I really must go. Please don't despair. I know people who... People who'd be willing to help Just me. go ahead and dip, bro. Go ahead and dip, bro. It's, it's all good. Keep it in mind. Oh, look, it's the purple guy. Purple. So purple. Uh oh, let's go guys. Where the bloody hell is Duncan? Now ah, fuck him if he's angry. I'm without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us, but I'm confident we've enough strength of our own. Your men are ready to act if needed. Sir Royland, I trust you'll keep a level head. Of course, my lord. But the bastard of Bolt... You're the last line defense. The but you're Bolt's the last line. You, you're not the first line. Do not do shit. Do not do anything fucking crazy. Hmm. 
something wrong with your gate? Well, aren't you the little lord? No wonder you can't open the gate. Shall we help you? Now let me in. This is a lovely pile of timber, isn't it? You're welcome inside, but your men are not. Did you hear that, men? The Lord of the House says, Fuck off. I think he's afraid of you. Wait here. For now. A token for the new Warden of the North. Let me guess. Ethan, don't Forrester look. Iron. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Ironwood. Doesn't look like much. No one can match our skill. Is that so? <gasps> Not bad. Lord Whitehill. Can your lot do this? Given enough time, we could... Given learn. enough time, you could do a great many things. But not this, apparently. Ethan, stop being nervous. Quite the army you have, Lord Forrester. Very impressive. Ethan, why are you so nervous? Come on, bro. There you go. Put the game face on. Game face. Look at that. More foresters. Lord Ramsay. Come out where I can see you. Force him to focus on the business at hand. What is it you want, Lord Ramsay? What do I want? Everything. Nothing. We'll see. First. Let's see you bend the knee to my father. Lord Bolton. Warden of the North. Words are mm. weak. Anyone can say they're loyal. I want you to show me. My lord. We need to keep our words. That, that wasn't so hard now, was it? Here's the thing. I don't care about your loyalty. The Crown, however, wants what you've got. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries. Ships, shields, chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. My father has promised as much to the King. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. You needn't worry. Your father will have what he needs. That's a good little lord. You can't trust a forester. They murdered our men. It Shut the fuck up, Pop and Fresh. Who did it? One Whitehill soldier dead. One Bolton. Yet your man lived. Our men are dead. Oh, shit. Fuck. Lived. You had me stand out in the wind and muck so you could show off your pathetic little army. That sort of insolence from one of our loyal bannermen will not do. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. The White Hills will be taking control of your Ironwood from this day forward. What? What? The Ironwood? But... The White Hills are nothing more than up-jump thieves! You can't do that! 
Why not? You know something the White Hills don't? We are talking about trees. You grow them, you cut them down. We have loyal craftsmen who make the finest weapons. The White Hills have no such craftsmen. Do you want ironwood for the next five years? Or the next fifty generations? The little lord does have a point. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half of your iron wood, and we'll see who fares better. But my lord... Half of something is better than the nothing you had before. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of... 20 men <gasps> within your walls. At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ethan! They'll help maintain the king's peace. And make sure there's no more trouble. This will cause more trouble, not less. <laughs> not for me. How the fuck did they get in? You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. Griff will lead the garrison. The seven hells he will. Lads, do make this visit worthwhile. Please, Sir Roiland, don't. Look at this little forester. You're not frightened, are you? Lord Ramsay, please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? I'm his twin, my lord. Oh, twins. Well, like the Queen and her brother. Well, <laughs> hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. <laughs> Damn it. Fucking Ramsay. I never had a sister. Always wanted one. Enough, Lord Snow. I have an idea. You'll come with me. You can be my highborn ward. Lord <gasps> Ramsay, that's enough. Do you like hunting? Let her go. Oh, She's no. quite pretty, your sister. <gasps> I suppose you can stay. Aren't you the bold lord? Oh, oh fuck. What have you done? Mm. No. But I don't Ethan. want a bold no. lord. Oh, uh, fuck. Okay, oh, well. Trouble. God damn it. Ethan! God damn it. Even though you did bend the knee. I think we've come to an understanding. I certainly feel better about all this. Oh god, I'm squirting. I'm squirting. However, the foresters need to keep Oh, I just fucking splashed on her dress. Holy shit. Stop! Take the boy as your ward. Kill him if they give you any trouble. This is some bullshit. Lovely meeting all of you. We'll have to do it again sometime. Somebody uh, help quickly! You brought this on yourself. Mother! Please stop! Don't let them take me! Oh. You will not take stop him! Help me! Please! Please. No. 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 Do something! Ethan? Oh. My son. I've I played the game wrong. I played it fucking wrong. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, you know. Fuck Ramsey, though. Ah, uh, that's. Yeah, it's pretty fucked up. Ethan sacrificed oh, next himself time. for us all. He saved Talia's life. He'll be remembered as Ethan the Brave. This house needs a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. My sister asked you to swear loyalty oh, to her son, shit. and you did it without flinching. We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forrester above all other loyalties. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Green. Ryan is home again, our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Are you prepared for what might happen? Damn. 
Well, guys. Well, yeah, yeah let's look at our let's look at our stats. Sixty uh, five percent stake with Bowen. Sixty two percent swollen. Okay. Wow, a lot of people didn't take the guy's fingers. Uh, a lot of people did not meet, or did not pick uh, the other guy as I know. And about 50-50 with Ramsey at the gate. Okay. Hmm. Well, guys, <laughs> that was an interesting first chapter. I fucked up, and I got killed. So, <laughs> god damn it. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and end this session off right here. Thank you guys for joining me on this just complete foster cluck of an adventure. And I will be back soon with more Game of Thrones. But until then, this is No Taco signing off. I will see you guys later.